want to talk real quick about coming up under Shotty Red, like, yeah. like what that meant to you, and like what's it like working with him, man. Yeah, man, you know Shotty Red, my brother, man. Shout out to him, man. He he got me where I'm at today. If it wasn't for him, I definitely wouldn't be here. You know, found me up in my space. You know, like a young young dude, man. Just like hit me out. He hit me up. Gave me his number, man. The rest was history. Yeah, you guys killed that who that man. Everyone's yeah, yeah. still talking about that yeah, one. Yeah, man, that definitely, definitely the track that that did it all for me. You know, turned everything around, turned my whole life around. He moved me to Atlanta, moved me with him. You know, had me working. You know, meeting a lot of people, make a lot of things happen. You know, so. So what? What? Like, tell us a little bit about making that beat, the who that, and how you guys got the Jeezy and everything. Well, you know, I used to make a lot of beats at my grandma's house, like on a little desktop. You know, computer with little Logitech speakers, you know, sending them a lot of beats. And I never knew that one was going to get placed, you know what I mean, because I made so many. But I sent it to him. He hit me back like a month later, said, Jeezy jumped on it. I didn't believe him. And, <laughs> up, you know, up until the day the album came out, that's when I found out, you know what I mean. And it just changed then. He he made it happen, and, you know, that's, that was his oh, that's, that's a cool story, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Things changed quick. And then the Super Freak, I know Jeezy came back to get that Super Freak track and with 2 chains. like tell yeah. us a little bit about that, man. Yeah, man, the uh, crazy thing about it, you know, I made a song called, uh, we made a song called Win Win, actually, and that was on the, on the mixtape or whatever, and uh, I made Win Win and Super Freak the same day, but I didn't send him the beat for Super Freak, I just sent him the win, and he sent me a text back, like, how he loved it, so, you know, later on, I sent him Super Freak, and he let me know it was going, you know, be the one on the album, but I never knew Two Chain was on it until um, I went to bring him the files for the uh, beat. Went up the password, brought the files, and I heard the song. I, you know what I mean? I knew it was gonna do what it was gonna do. You know what I mean? So that was a big thing. Hell yeah, man! Like, what's it like working with Jeezy and Two Chain, man? Man, Jeezy, my brother. You know what I mean? Shout out to Jeezy, man. I only met Two Chain one time, was just a handshake. You know, letting him know who I was. But you know, Jeezy, my brother. Like he, when I lived with Shawty Red, you know, he's he kind of moved in with us for like four or five months and looked out for us on a big, you know what I mean, big way, you know what I mean? So that's forever, my brother, you know what I mean? Yeah, well, you guys make classics together, man. Oh, definitely, definitely. You know what I mean? Uh, shout out to him, too. we actually working right now. I just sent him some more beats, and uh, we'll probably be in the studio in a few weeks, too. He got some projects coming out, too. That's dope. And then I want to talk about working with Rocco. Maybe you have a bunch of tracks with Rocco and that change track. Yeah, man. Uh, that one goes extra hard, man. Like, what's it like working with Rocco? Yeah, man, Rocco, he real, he, he got a good work ethic, you know what I mean? He, he knock out a lot of songs, you know what I mean? He, he might do a song and it'd be perfect, and he'll just redo the verse over and make it, you know what I mean? He, he like, he, he got a real good work ethic, you know? I love being in the studio with Rocco, man. Shout out to Rocco. He actually, he bought me some keyboards, too, you know what I mean? So, that's my, that's like my boy, too, man. Shout out to Rocco, man. He can go hard. Yeah, man, no, Rocco's on top of his game right now. He's one of, like, the best people doing it right now with the mixtapes and the putting everything together and creating real motivational music, man. Yeah, man, he, he definitely got the gift of the gap, you know what I mean? <laughs> but uh, I, I, love, I love the music. Actually, man, he got, he got some new projects coming out. I don't know when it's dropping, but it's going to take the world by storm because it's big. Like, he, he's big. Lyrical, too. He, he on a lyrical game, tough, you know what I mean? Like, for real, for real, so... Yo, that's your boy D-Rich checking in, man, right here at Hip Hop and Lunch. Signing out, baby.